What's going on guys, it's Swimzy here, and welcome back to a brand new Warframe video. Now in this video we're going to be looking at the Golden Instinct Helmet ability. Now you can unlock this ability by hitting rank 10 with the Helmet system, and you simply either subsume Warframes, or you can equip other abilities onto certain frames. Now in this video I'm going to show you how this ability works, what happens if the ability works, and just the complexity of this ability because half the time it doesn't work so it actually depends on if you have any secrets or any sculptures in your mission. If you did like this video please like share and subscribe as everything helps me out and I want to hit 500 subscribers before the end of the year. You guys have been doing so well with the support you've shown me so thank you very much and let's get into the video. So this is the helmet room which you can actually either remove cysts off of your warframes, you can add invigorations for certain warframes, or you can change abilities for your current loadout. Now I have the Golden Instinct for Harrow on right now. So this ability sends out a short-lived void spark that is drawn towards the nearest medallion, I attend sculpture, rare crate, unscanned curia or unscanned fragment. This ability is very useful for getting all of the couriers, all the fragments if you were into lore, and it also helps you get I-10 sculptures for endo. And this ability also helps you get the medallions for your syndicate that you choose. There are six syndicates, I believe, so depending on which one you chose, you can use this ability to help you find the medallions to get more standing with that current faction. Now, to be able to get this ability, you actually need to unlock all of these metamorphoses. Now, every time you subsume a Warframe or add an ability to your Warframe, it will actually use materials. So make sure you keep stocked up on these. But once you unlock all of these metamorphoses, as you can see, go all the way down to the 15th and final, you unlock the ability Golden Instinct. And this is the ability we are going to focus on today. So I'm just gonna show you some gameplay on how this ability works. And I'm also gonna show you the best way to find sculptures or rare crates depending on if we get lucky so let's start up a random mission and let's see if this ability works so right now i'm trying to use my second ability and it says airy is barren that means there are no syndicate medallions or rare crates or curias or sculptures in the area so it's a pretty hit and miss ability pretty much what you want to do is just go throughout the mission and keep trying to use this ability and eventually something will happen if you get lucky. This ability is all about luck. It doesn't really help in any other way. So if you're lucky and it actually gets to proc, then you have a secret in the area. So I'm going to fast forward until we find one. And if we don't, I'm going to start another mission. And hopefully we get lucky the second time around. All right, so we are in a new mission. This is the Spy on Earth. And if I use this ability, it is now working. So when this ability is activated and you see that Golden Instinct spark shoot out, you wanna follow it. Now the spark doesn't go very far, so you're gonna to have to keep using this ability. So I'm going to speed this up so you can see where this location actually is. Okay, so we are at the secret. Now, I'm pretty sure this is a Curia location. Yep, it is. So, keep in mind, if you are trying to find all the Curias, if you use this ability, the ability will only show you ones that you have not actually seen yet. So, I just scanned this one, and now the ability won't work. So, this ability, if you are looking to hunt Curia locations, it will only show you the ones you have not scanned yet. So please keep that in mind. Now that we've found a Curia, I'm now going to go into a different mission and try to find an I-10 sculpture. And I'm going to show you how this ability works while trying to find them. Alright, so I just started up an infested salvage mission because that is actually the best way to get sculptures. Since this mission tile set is very small, you can only get a 1 out of 7 chance for an I-10 to spawn. So let's see if there is a sculpture here. Oh. This is promising. 
Now, while I wait for this timer, I'm going to speed this up because a 20 second timer for an ability of this caliber is actually ridiculous. It doesn't even go very far, and then you have to wait 20 whole seconds. Alright, this should be the last ability we need to use. And there we have it, an I-10 Sarth Sculpture. So, yes guys, this ability does in fact work. Uh, it's just not the best. Unlocking 15 Metamorphosis takes a really long time. So, this ability is worth it in some aspects, but it really isn't worth it in the long run. If you do need I-10 Sculptures or Curious, you could always look up the Curia Guide on the internet. Or you can just do arbitrations or the weekly Maru's Bazaar for those sculptures. So this ability isn't really worth it. There's a lot of better ways to actually find Syndicate medallions, e.g. using Limbo with Loot Detector. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope this video did help. If you did like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. And let me know down below your thoughts on the Golden Instinct ability. That being said, thank you all so much for watching. It's been Swim, guys. Later. Fearless.